Standard tuning ang ating gitara ngayon and low capo version ang ituturo sa inyo sa napakaganda at very emotional ang kantang ito ni Sir Jonoy Danao ang ikaw at ako. So be ready guys dahil mahihirap o oh, advanced na chords na ang gagawin natin at talagang challenge kayo. So yeah, let's get started. Alright, so here's the first chord lineup for the intro. First is A. Ipuha kayo ng ganito. Um, fourth string, seventh fret. Third string, sixth fret. Second string, and yung first string sa fifth fret. Right. Then, G sharp diminish seven. So, move lang natin itong fourth string sa sixth fret. Third string, seventh fret. Sixth fret lang din itong second string. At yung first string, seventh fret lang din, guys. Next is F sharp minor. So, hindi ganito na F sharp minor yung gagawin natin. Like this. So, fourth string. Again, sa, ayan, sa fourth fret naman ngayon. Tapos, ilagay nyo itong index sa second fret. Third and second string, guys. Then, i-extend nyo itong pinky sa first string, fifth fret. <laughs> and finally, F sharp diminish seven. Paano yun? Parang G sharp diminish 7 lang kaganina. But, ilalagay nyo siya dito sa 3rd fret. So, 3rd, 4th, 3rd, and 4th. Okay, stop muna tayo dyan. And, explain ko muna yung finger picking, which is an RPG-ated style, gaya ng ginawa ni Sir Jonoy. So, follow the guide numbers on the screen. Ayan. So, mukha siyang mathematics, pero hindi yan. Mathematics. So, madali lang yan. So, ang number na nakikita nyo ngayon is represents the string numbers na kailangan nyo i-plug. Kung ang number is may open and close parenthesis, ang ibig sabihin nun is you should plug two strings at the same time. Kapag may comma naman between numbers, it means you'll plug them one after another or one at a time. Gets nyo? So, for example, dito sa A chord, yan, 4-1 diba na may parenthesis. So, magkasabay yun. 4, 1, tapos yun na. Magkasunod na. 4, 3, 2, 1. Tapos 3, 2, 1. So, descending lang yung pattern. Yan. Ah. Tapos, dito naman sa G sharp diminish, magbabago na yung pattern dyan. So, 4, 1 ulit. Then, 3, 2, Tapos, 3 ulit. Then, 1. Ganon. After nun, sundan nyo siya ng 3, 2, 1. Ganon. Tapos, sa uh, F naman, same lang ng pattern sa G sharp diminish. Yun, hanggang dun lang sa first string. So, bitin yung pattern, no? So, 4, 1, 3, 2, 3, 1. Pause. Yan. Okay, second line up na tayo. We're starting on D. Next, A slash C sharp. A with the base of C sharp. Tapos, lagay nyo tong second string sa fifth fret. After nyan is B minor 7. Then, passing chord. B minor 7 over E, or we can call it Isus 9. So, tanggalin nyo lang itong ring finger. So, naka-open yung 6th string, no? So, ganyan lang. Okay, sundan nyo ulit ako. Ganyan lang yung pattern. B minor 7. Passing chord, downward sa Isus 9. Yeah. After nun, may A pa pala siya. Nakalimutan ko lang. <laughs> yung A niya, pwedeng ganito. So, ang pattern dyan is 5th, 4th, 2nd, 3rd, then 1st. Or pwede nyo siyang kunin dito.
Okay, i-play ulit natin sa normal speed itong intro. Sabay nyo ako. Itong verse natin guys, pareho lang yan sa intro but may minor difference lang sa pattern pagdating dito sa last part between B minor 7 to Isus 9. Play ko muna, simula dito sa A over C sharp. Tapos ito na, yung pattern dito sa B minor 7, gagayahin lang natin yung sa A over C sharp. Isus 9, instead na downward lang siya, ganito yung pattern. So, play natin together yung 6, 2nd, and 1st string, followed by 4th, 3rd, 2nd, and 1st string. So, descending lang ulit. Yan. Tapos, sa dulo, lalagyan natin ng A. So, yung pattern dito, same lang kaganina. So, tandaan nyo lang yung pattern dito sa A para di na kayo babalik-balik. So, second line na tayo dito sa verse. Ulit lang tayo, no? Yeah, dito sa second line, nagbago na naman yung pattern. Pagdating dito sa A over C sharp, so ganito na siya. Um, ganun ulit, fifth and second string, tapos fourth, third and second string. So hanggang dun lang, bitin yung pattern no, dito sa chord na to. Tapos B minor 7 ka agad. So ganun lang sa B minor 7, fifth, third and second string lang yan. Tapos A ka agad. Ganun ulit yung pattern. Again, so play natin ulit dito sa D. Ayos, sasunod pa kayo. So continue na tayo dito sa chorus sa part ng Sanay D mag maliw. So magbabago na yung chord progression doon. We're starting on D. Tapos D sharp diminish 7 naman ngayon. 1st, 2nd, 1st, 2nd. Next is A. Tapos F sharp 7, flat 13. So, ganito lang siya. Bar nyo tong index, 2nd fret. Tapos, itong 3rd and 2nd string. Yan, sa 3rd fret. Tapos, add nyo tong pinky sa 4th fret, 4th string. Tapos, F sharp 7. Alisin nyo lang tong ring finger, 2nd string. Ganun lang. So, yan yung first line niya. Mas madali yung plucking dito, guys. No? So, ganito lang. 4-1 ulit. Tapos, 3-2-1. So, pababa lang. Same pattern. Sa A, 5-2 naman ngayon. Tapos, 4-3-2. This note, 4th, 3rd, and 2nd string, play together, followed by 4th string. Then sa F sharp 7, yan, remove na yung ring finger, play nyo itong 4th, 3rd, and 2nd string. Again. Yan. Next lineup of chords is B minor 7. Then E, ganito yung finger position. Open 6th string, skip nyo na yung 5th string, 4th string ka agad sa 2nd fret, and 3rd string, 1st fret, 2nd string, open. Then A, tapos E ulit, 
pero naka-open lang siya. So, ang piplay niya dyan is 6th string, 2nd string, tsaka yung 3rd string. Tapos after nun, isang bagsak lang na A7. So play natin dito sa B minor 7. Sundan nyo lang yung pattern sa screen. E A Tapos E ulit. Yan, ganun lang, no? Sa E, 6th string, and 3rd string, sabay, boss, 3rd string. So, magsak sa A7. Then, third lineup of chords, magsisimula siya dito sa D major 7. Pattern is descending. Then, C sharp 7, na parang C. Angat yun lang na isang fret. Then, add nyo tong pinky sa 3rd string, 4th fret. Tapos, F sharp minor 7, ang gagawin nyo, ibar nyo lang tong index. Then, add nyo lang tong 4th string sa 4th fret. So, 6th, 4th, 3rd, and 2nd string yung pattern doon. Tapos, B7, downward, or isang bagsak lang. Ibang variation nga lang ng B7 yung gagawin natin, no? So, 2nd, 1st, 2nd, open, and 2nd. Yan. So, ulitin natin sa part na to, sa D major 7. Ganun. Then, hindi pa tayo tapos dyan. May last part pa tayo. D major 7 ulit. Tapos, C sharp minor 7 to B minor 7. Then, E sus 9. This last chord is A. Yun. So, that's all the chords para sa chorus. So, i-play natin, no? So, ayan lahat ng chords sa verses and also sa chorus, no? So, medyo madami talaga, pero uh, alam kong kayang-kaya niyo yung aralin to, basta tiyagain niyo lang, no? So, let's move on sa interlude. So, sa part naman na to, parang same lang sa first line of chorus, but half lang yung kokopyain natin doon. So, check this out. Verse 2 and second chorus, pareho lang. After that is bridge or yung guitar solo. And here's the chords and pattern. So F sharp minor 7, na ganito ulit yung finger position. Tapos yung pattern is bass, fourth, third, fourth, second. Tapos followed by fourth, third, and second. Again. sa C sharp 7 ganun ulit yung pattern so bass 4th 3rd 4th 2nd 4th 3rd and 2nd back to F sharp minor 7 then B7 5th 4th 3rd 2nd then downward again Then, yung second line ng guitar solo na to is ganito ulit. D major 7, C sharp minor, B minor. Then, instead na E sus 9, gagawin nyo siyang B minor 7 flat 5 with the bass of E. Yan. Again. Okay. 
So, last chorus tayo guys. Ang pinagkaiba nga lang is 2 times natin ipiplay yung chord progression natin na to. So, D major 7 yun, di ba? Tapos C sharp. F sharp minor. 2 B7. Tapos yun ulit. Then, dito na tayo sa last part niya. Ngayon at kailanman. So, ang chord doon, D major 7 to B minor. So, skip na natin yung C sharp minor 7. Tanggalin na yan. Ngayon at kailanman. Then, last chord is E. Sa outro, gayahin nyo lang to guys. So, unang chord is G flat major 7. Magkakasunod lang. So, ang pattern is descending. 4, 3, 2, 1, 2, 3. Then downwards sa G flat 6 slash 9. That's the end of our tutorial. Salamat ulit sa nag-request ng song na to. And yeah, sana ay nag-enjoy kayong lahat at nakasunod naman kayo. So, kitaks na lang sa next tutorial and have a nice day. Peace!